For the first day of boot camp, we actually hit the ground running. We had a lot to do in one day. We started learning the first song of our competitive set. We had a gig to go to. Where are we going? We're we going to Aspen. Okay. <laughs> and then when we got back from the gig, we of course had lunch and then we learned some choreo with our new choreographer, Anne Marie. She taught us how to be flexible with our bodies and just help us feel more comfortable. And then at night we did a fun social activity where we all exchanged gifts and food for each other. So yeah, that was a lot of fun and a great way to end the first day. On day two of boot camp, we finished up learning the first song of our set. We worked a lot on our rhythm. <laughs> so, uh, one of Michael's sleeves is longer than the other. Do you have it? Well, yeah, there's no other way to wear a shirt, so no, I guess. No, yeah, I try. I, like, kept pulling. It, it doesn't go down. <laughs> oh. <laughs> well. I'm so done. During day three of boot camp, we started the second song in our set, beginning with some vocal effects from the higher voices. <laughs> when I came back from sectionals and heard the ladies do this, I was blown away. <laughs> Awesome. The only complaint I have is that mm. although I'm in the front for like 90% of it, it's not a hundred and I feel like that right. kind of Break in there is yeah. something so that I probably shouldn't do. Um, no, this actually is a is a mega vibe fail. Okay. It did not pass the vibe check. All right, it's after day three of boot camp, and Michael and I are here in Swope finishing up the second arrangement. And uh, as you can tell, oh, oh, <laughs> is it going backwards now? Oh wait, so time has now stopped. I, I think you noticed the hand being weird before. I don't even know what to say. <laughs> The last day before a few days off. We worked on rhythms within the second song. No need for prisoners. Bitch, please. Finished up some choreo for the second song. <laughs> and sat down at the end of the day to reflect on the past four days. Liz? Um, so for my literal first time doing a cappella. <laughs> <laughs> Day four in the group. Day, day four. Day four in UAR. Um, oh I was like really nervous and like not sure what to expect out of like boot camp, but I'm really happy with like how like positive and encouraging and welcoming the environment is and how supportive everyone is of each other's success. I'm just really happy. <laughs> I'm. 100% proud of all three of our new members. Yes. The, the hard work that you've done. You've never done this before. Oh, we finished boot camp one. <laughs> but we're done! Yeah! And Steven doesn't have a coat on. Goodbye, Swope. Bye, Swope. See you in three days. After a well-needed few days off, we got right back into things. We started learning choreo and music for the third song of our set. Hi! Hey, what's going on here? We're doing choreo. Okay. This is where it is. Uh, <laughs> you know what? Dilly Bites became a UAR bootcamp staple, and if you don't know what they are, go to your local Wawa and please try them. Once again, we worked a lot with rhythms on bootcamp 2 day 2. Ready? And ha, da, 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 da. And 
Ann, Spencer ate my biggest fear, a Wawa hot dog. <laughs> Spencer eating a hot dog for lunch. The game of life really do be crazy. <laughs> We don't have a lot of footage from Boot Camp 2 Day 3, but we did start the closer of our set. On the last day of Boot Camp 2, Spencer put a new mantra on the board that a few of us couldn't quite grasp. Breath like you're taking it on <coughs> A? Bread. Yeah, like bread. Yeah, bread. <laughs> so, what does that mean? I don't think I know that word. I'm blind. Majors, so. There might be, I don't think there's I'll, an A. I'll look it up the definition. Yeah. So, like. Uh, uh, wait, that's a real word. Yeah. yeah. I thought this, this was like, a joke. Obviously, like, how deep you can go into something with breath is like how, it's like the amount. So, it's like, mm -hmm. um, usually mm -hmm. it's like used to describe like how wide something is or how large something is. For me, what that means is how much we really know about like a particular point and how deep we can get into that, like into the nitty gritty details of it versus how much we can really do across the entire song and can we keep that going and what does it look like to memorize the entire part. What are we about to do? We switched up our dance warm up a little, worked on choreo, and then sat down at the end of the day to talk about how we were all feeling. Cole, can we go around and talk a little bit about like how we're feeling about second boot camping over? I feel very accomplished. I feel ready. Oh, this is my fourth boot camp, and it's just like it's hidden different this year. <laughs> <laughs> I'm very exhausted. I feel proud that we could put this all together. You know what? I feel clean with the music and the choreo. I feel very comfortable just around you guys. Like, as you can see, I'm very crazy. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, so I'm honestly very grateful. I feel prepared. I have not even had 10 rehearsals with the group. <laughs> um, I feel good. The last two days of boot camp are always pretty crazy. We're not done yet. <laughs> the second to last day, we started working on memorization. We will have a row of stands across the front of the room, and we will sing through a large chunk of the music, and then we'll do the choreo for that same chunk, and then we'll sing and do the choreo together. And took some time to have our <laughs> annual photo shoot in our set outfits. Picture day. <laughs> Don't know why, but the only way to mentally and physically get through being in the cold was by singing Ed Sheeran really badly. <laughs> want us to be as productive as possible to have a very great per first performance for an audience yeah in the afternoon that's at 3 p.m We're at the end of the day we talked about the focus group like that we would be having the next day Boot Camp 2020, we had our focus group. The focus group is a great way for us to get feedback on what outside eyes and ears pick up from what we've done during boot camp. It gives us great things to keep in mind and take with us into the semester to work on. Can you take a video of us? All right, well, so what do we think so far? Um, well, I cried, so you let me know. Um, I uh, know, I might have shed a tear, so. <laughs> Anyways, um, hope, hope <laughs>
hope this makes it into the docu series one day. Just saying. Um, Kisses.